Hi, I'm Rhonda Holiday. I'm from the U-Haul of Katy at 746044 in Katy, Texas. We're going to install a hitch on this RAV4 today. Uh, once we're finished, you'll be able to use it to, for a bike rack, a basket, and pulling U-Haul trailers. You will need the tool seen here to complete this installation. We're going to take the, the protective cover off on the driver's side. It's required before we can get started here. Take a screwdriver and pull down on the tabs. You're going to take the tie down that they use to bring the cars over and take it off. It takes a 17 millimeter. It's going to Take that off of there real quick. Here at U-Haul, we have this awesome tool here that helps us raise these hitches up into place. Our hitch jack, it makes it easier for us to install the hitches. If you are by yourself and at home, you may need to have a second person to help you raise this hitch into place. Now we're gonna raise this up and get it up over the muffler. Slowly crank it up into place. And it slides right up behind the muffler so that we can get it in there. So now all you have to do is get your bolts. It tells you to take one at a time. Make sure you put your washer on your bolt. Have your lock nut, put it on there. You can just slide it up in there, hand tight first. Make sure that they all go in nice and smooth. Make sure that I have them all in hand tight before I start on anything, just to make sure that if I have to move the hitch that I haven't done too much work prior to making sure that they all fit. Okay, do the other side real quick. In this hitch, it has the oval hole so that you can slide the hitch back and forth just a little bit to adjust it to make sure that you have enough space to put your bolts in. You wanna be able to make sure that you can stick at least put it in hand tight, again, to make sure that you have enough space. See, we're having trouble with this one bolt. There's a bracket on this muffler, and it is an option to, to lower the muffler. So we're going to go ahead and lower the muffler. Just There's a grommet that you pull it off. We have a tool that you can do it with. This one's so easy to do that you can just take it right off. And now it's more out of the way, so you might be able to line up your bolt better and slide it right in. And it went right in, so it was easier to take it off. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and just tighten these up slightly so that they won't be as hard to install. And we use the torque wrench. Again, you want to make sure that they're hand tight and make sure that they're easily to... Real quick, to ensure that they're in place. And then we'll do the other side real quick. I'm going to pull back the muffler so we can get up in there. For this one, you can pull the muffler back and put your reach up in there. And you're just wanting to hit it enough. Okay. We're going to use our torque wrench here. It says to set it at 76 pounds. You're going to set it at 76. We needed a 19 millimeter socket. Put it on here. Get yourself set, line it up, and tighten it until it pop, until you hear the click. Mm -mm. 
On the back ones, you may want to use an extension so that you have enough leverage to be able to clear this so that you don't hit the bottom of the car. You have the five inch, fits right in, that you have more leverage so that you can reach and you're down lower and it hits. And then you can go to the other side. Again, you want to make sure you torque it until it pops. There you go. So we have to get the muffler to move out of the way. I don't have anybody to assist me at this time. So what we're going to do is we're going to get our trusty ratchet strap. We're going to wrap it around, pull it tight, and then just ratchet it so that it pulls the muffler over here out of the way. So we have enough space to get the impact up in there. And that's it. So we now we have the muffler loose. We have to get our muffler hooked back up on its end. Just dab a little bit of this soapy water in that little hole there. Raise your muffler into place and slide it over into place so that it's secured again. This is our two inch receiver, our 5 8 hole for our pin, the two brackets for our chain, safety chains. It has our rate, the ratings and the bracket for our wiring harness as well. This concludes our hitch install for the RAV4. Thank you. To learn more about the product seen in this video or to schedule an installation by a U-Haul Hitch Professional, visit us online today at uhaulhitches.com dot com.